Uh, so I'm here uh, Thursday night following training. Uh, I've been joined by Nathan Ferguson and Charles Clayton. Dare I call you the, the newbies of the Willstone squad. Yeah. Uh, both of you joined in, in February. Nathan from, from Southend uh, as part of the league and Charles, you've joined Aaron Henry on loan from, from Charlton Athletic. Yeah. So first of all, let's just start with uh, just a little bit of intro, a bit about yourselves and your footballing kind of background. Uh, well, I was at Southend, I signed it a year ago, last year, January. Um, I was at Cooley before that. Then in League Two? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. And have you found the, the kind of the, the, the difference in class between League Two and the National League? Is, is there one, I guess, is the, the first question? I think the National League's more physical. Maybe physically a bit, it's a bit different than, yeah. than League Football, but it is pretty similar in terms of quality. Though. Yeah, yeah. And Charles, from under 23s football into. Uh, yeah. National League football, how have you found that and kind of how's that matched up with your just, expectations? No, so I think it's been good the first few games, it's just a lot more, like you feel like, dare I say, you're almost playing for more, like I said, in the first team environment. Um, I said, like Mace, it's a lot more physical, um, but no, I think it's been good so far, so I've just got to keep going really. And you've had some experience of National League football with Leighton Orient before, yeah, is that right? Yeah, the White Gate said, um, yeah, so I was at Orient before I was at Charlton, um, yeah, so that was at Gate said a few years ago now, so yeah, no. Only half an hour, but yeah. Fair play. Yeah. Fair play. Not a lot of experience. And Nathan, you during during the pandemic, you set certainly social media on fire with uh, the one that go at Forest Green. Yeah. yeah. How, how how have you found kind of adapting the difference between I guess coming from from full time football into what is effectively a part time squad? Is there is there a big difference there? Um, well? It's tough because you've got a lot more you've got a lot more time on your hands, especially during the day. Usually you'd be at training in the morning. Yes, yeah, you just gotta get get yourself a bit of a schedule so you're not bored at home. Do you know what I mean? And you you announced yourself with a bit of a bang. Uh, we got the win on your debut against Yeovil, and then of course the literal bang against Barnet. Yeah. Uh, how aside from obviously scoring the goal, an important goal in terms of the league position, how much did you know about the rivalry with Barnet? And um, well, other than the location, I didn't know too much about it. Everyone was saying it's a derby, but. I actually didn't realise how much of a derby it was, so good. Yeah, and uh, and, and Charles, your your obviously Saturday was behind closed doors, yeah. um, but certainly the Wrexham game with with two thousand. Uh, we we won't talk about the chance you had at the end there, but uh, <laughs> still going. Over the <laughs> still going. Uh, how have you found adapting to? I mean, you've played, you've had some first team experience with Charles. Yeah, right? I think I think sort of League One and in the cup games I played this year. I think. Obviously, that, that level's more technical. Um, I tell you, there's still an element of similarity in terms of physicality, running, and stuff like that. Um, but no, as I said, like you've, you've just got to adapt to the three different levels. So this is a lot more physical league, um, a lot more set pieces. You know, you've got to switch on, um, especially in the past few games. Um, and have you set yourself kind of any expectations or, or goals for, for your time here? I think I think just uh, play as many minutes as I can, help the team. Um, try and chip in with a sister or a goal here and there as well. Um, so yeah, just try and hit teams as much as I can and play as many games as I can. That's what you know. It's, it's sort of about. And Nathan, big games coming up against some of the teams around us at the bottom. Now you've had a few games to kind of settle in and, and learn about the squad. What what do you think the squad can achieve? I mean, I think our league position doesn't necessarily show the quality that we have in our squad. I think we can be a bit higher. The last few games we could have won. I mean. We should have won, to be honest. So, yeah, I think we can do a lot better. Are you confident we can stay up? 100%. Fantastic. Cheers, brother.